Hi, in this video we're going to show you a couple newer features of Google Lens, which is included in the Google Chrome web browser. So if you've never used Google Lens, uh, it's kind of a way you could kind of take a picture, so to say, of something and get more information about it. And if you use an Android phone, then you most likely have the Google Lens feature on that as well. All right, so we're going to show you a couple things you could do with it in Google Chrome. All right, so one nice feature is the ability to extract text from an image. So this is just an image, so I can't, I can't do anything with the text. I can't highlight it, copy the text. I could just copy the image. So what you can do is once you have the image open, click in the address bar, and that will give you the Google Lens option right here. Click on that, and then we'll draw a box around it. And then let go. Then we have the option to select text, translate, or copy as image. So we'll select the text. And you can see it also does the Google Gemini AI feature to give you more information about it. And then some search results as well that are related. And we can take that text, paste it into our document here, just like so. All right, so now let's try it on another one that's a different language. So this one is in French. So we'll just highlight the text here. And this time we could translate it. And you could also see over on the right here that it gives you some related images and quotes and that type of thing. And you could see it extracted the text from the image and then translated it as well. And it will also give you some related search results based on what it finds. All right, so now we have this page in Spanish here. So, of course, with Google and other browsers, you could go up here and go to Translate and translate the whole thing. Or you could also use the Google Lens. Click in the box here in the address bar. Highlight what you want. Let's just say this part here. Translate. There we go. And you could also do things. Let me shrink this down a bit here. Let's say we wanted this right here. Copy as image. You can see it gives us some other similar looking images off to the side here. But we could just take this and paste it in as well. Kind of like using the snipping tool to take screenshots, but you could do it right from Chrome. All right, and then finally, we have a video here that has some closed captioning. So it'll actually work with videos as well. So we could select the text, translate a copy as image. And if we choose select text, you'll see that it actually finds the line from this movie here and gives you more information about it and actually adds to it. So that's a nice feature as well. And of course, you know, you could try it on other things. Let's say let's do it to this ad here. All right, so it found this cremation service, like so. Select the text. It kind of gives you some other information with the same search results. Like that. So overall, Google Lens is a nice feature. You might find it useful. You know, if you're on a certain web page and you want to find out some more information about something specific, uh, you could use it to highlight the text and click on Select Text, and then it'll give you some more search results based on what it finds with that text. It's kind of similar to doing this option here when you select something, right click, and search Google for it. Kind of give you the same type of results. It's just another option here. All right, so once again, just whatever page you're on, click in the address bar, click on Google Lens, highlight what you want. You can see it found the ad block from this Pi service here, and even a Reddit post on it, found some more of their logos, and so on. All right, so give it a shot and see how it works for you. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.
Thank you.